In early 2016, it was rumored that Kori Nakatani was contemplating retirement. We would soon find out that wasn't the case at all. Some people have made that statement, but I never officially said I was going to retire. Uh, I had a few issues of uh, actually had walking pneumonia, so now that it's out, you know. Um, there's some other things that happened with my wife having, an, she battled through cancer, thyroid cancer. We had her thyroid taken out, and uh, then she had a blood clot from that, an, aneur or an aneurysm, and then a blood clot. And then so, make a long story short, it, it's been a tough eight months, but you know, thank God we're healthy. She's doing better, and uh, I'm able to go, come back and do what I love to do is ride races. After Corey Nakatani reached a certain point in his fitness, he knew it would take everything he had in him to be ready for opening day at Santa Anita. I think we had 18 days to, before Santa Anita opened up, and I felt myself I needed to get to that next level of fitness, and, and I couldn't do it just by what I was doing. I went to Becky over here at Sierra Fitness, and uh, she got me that last 18 days was really grueling, but uh, we were able to, to pull it off, and. I feel great. Coming up, up to Breeders' Cup was really, about a month or two before, I was really on and saying, come on, Dad, no, it's time to go back, it's time to do this. I knew um, when my dad took some time off that I would be the key to getting him back to riding. Um, and when I presented it to him and, you know, got him to come back, uh, it ultimately was, you know, just perfect idea for me was, I know what I'm going to do, I'm going to be your agent. I think he's a pretty smart rider, you know, he's been getting to know my horses and he has a lot of confidence in me and um, we've got off to a good start. And Corey Nakatani stamping his return to the saddle. Good year for Roses, beat Pretty Girl five length. Watch this cat wins by nine. The support from everybody is they love that, you know, it's a father-son relationship. He can be tough at some times and he's hard on me. That's which I like. At this point in his career, Corey Nakatani still has a lot left he wants to accomplish. His passion for this sport is stronger than ever and nothing will stop him from reaching his goals. My biggest achievement was just getting them back, and, 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 um, and now I'm happy to have them back, and now we're taking uh, you know, steps forward to ultimately you know, getting towards our goals and things like that. I, I personally, myself, want to win the Kentucky Derby, get to the upper echelon, and, and if I can do that, it, I'd be sitting on cloud nine. There's a lot of great horsemen in the backside. You know? I want to thank them for giving me an opportunity. You, know, it's, you can't win races sitting in a jocks room. And, uh, I, as much as I love winning races and, and, and riding, you can't make a difference when you're not out on the track, so uh, hopefully the horseman will give me an opportunity to ride for him. I don't, you know, I love, I love riding, and, and I don't, I ride for anybody and, you know, go out there and give it my all.